are you? This is a little bit different today. What have I done? What have I bought? We're about to find out. Oops. <laughs> Can't show that side, but whatever. So, in quarantine, you're flipping through Instagram at night. Some things catch your eyes. So I had a couple of things that caught my eyes. And it's NBA, not, not football, not North Stars football, not MMA, but hoops of all things. With the canceled season, but yeah, it's from the Bucks. So enough of that, let's just get to it. Let's rip it open. You see them as I see them. Um, got really good deals on these. I paid the extra money to get it shipped with tracking. Uh, I know these are authentic. Uh, I know the guy, the guy who sold them to me, I know where he got them from. Uh, so I know that they're legit, but he has just, he had just had so many of these and, um, I forget which is going to be which, but one of these will be blue and one will be black. And this is the black one and you can't see anything. So I'm going to have to put a nice screenshot of it up, but, um, I got these for under $30 shipped. I think, there was, I think this one was 25. I'm gonna send them off uh, through Card Cave, through Manny, to get the to get these authenticated. Shouldn't have a problem. But Giannis, the MVP, Antetokounmpo, from my Milwaukee Bucks. It's just kind of weird, like having the best season the Bucks have ever had, and then like it, COVID happens and it's just canceled. So. Boom, throwing that up on the screen. You guys, take a look. This was a really good price compared to some of the scribbles um, that he was selling um, for more money. But since it was black, I think it was a decent price. So I think I bought it for $20 plus $3 shipping. So, just, yeah, that's just it. That's just all that is. Um, I'm not like overly hyped about it, but I'm just happy that I'm doing a different video <laughs> than my typical uh, all MMA all the time. So let's look at this one. This one was the second one that I bought. And I think I picked it up for, hmm, this one might've been 23. That one might've been 25 shipped. So this one is actually in blue. I could have saved three bucks on it by having it shipped in a PWE. It was coming from Madison, which is only an hour and a half from here. Not even an hour and a half from here. Um, and if I would have been a little bit sooner, they could have been combined shipping. But, um, hmm, not as bold as I thought in blue. It's a little bit streakier than I thought from the Instagram pic, but that's fine. These are so cheap. I mean, buying the card for a couple bucks and but it's a Giannis auto. What are you going to do? I'm actually kind of surprised of the, of the condition of this one, but I'm not going to complain. They're on the cheap. And they were better autos than ones that were more expensive, in my opinion. Uh, there was ones that were like 45, 30, even 60 that I'd take these over those. Um, but let's get some really nice Giannis stuff from, from the past, from back when my sons and I went to a free Giannis before his MVP season. Um, waited in line a bit to get these done, but they all turned out real nice. Um, my son Joey got this one done. This is just a Walgreens print. Um, asked for inscriptions and I think we might have got these done with Sharpies back in the time, back in the day. But that's what my son got. My son got two Joey. I was hoping that if we asked for personalizations, we'd get a little bit more character on the on the on the photos in case he did a real short thing and he actually got the Greek freak auto on there. So I think this is eleven by fourteen, eleven by seventeen maybe. So you can kinda yeah, so there's that. I bet your mind's still stuck in there. And my son Luke got that banger on 
it is 11 by 14 so you can kind of see the difference yeah that versus that so this was this was obviously the photos were done at a sit down and we were in the first 50 people getting signatures there's supposed to be one more my 8x10 and of course I just went with an 8x10 because it's an NBA and I wasn't expecting very nice autographs and yeah it is what it is but there's DK's to David I didn't get fear the deer I should have made him put it on there but I was just happy to get more than um, the short sig that he puts on those cards so yeah so that's it that is my non MMA <laughs> video not many of those and I actually have it I still have that aforementioned um, MLB um, video to get to. Also, have a day in the life video. Actually, I did some vlogging to go get a special pickup. If you follow me on Instagram, that's a giveaway. Of what I picked up. My Instagram is at d double e a k a y three sixteen. So d a k three sixteen. D double e a k a y three sixteen. So that's it, guys. I'll get to the uh, finishing up. I'll get to finishing up the day in the life part of that. Um, <clears throat> the end part of that day in the life hunt, let's call it. Um, so yeah, I'll get to finishing that up soon, hopefully. Heading back to the office Monday, thankfully, too. I've been driving truck for the last week uh, while I'm on furlough from the office. So things are fine, but gonna go back to the office for a week and then back on furlough for a week so that's it hope you guys enjoyed it thanks for stopping by checking me out why don't you drop a comment let me know what you thought um i should have um known exactly how much i paid but the middle 20th for both those autos each and again paid three extra dollars for the sure shipping i don't want to take the chance on the pwes so that's it hopefully the next time you see those cards they'll be in psa dna slabs that's it. Take care, be safe, and uh, don't catch the COVID. <laughs>